What is up, guys? It is Uncle Bob, and welcome back to the channel. We are here for some more Breath of Fire 2, and uh, we're still trying to eliminate the fat from the Queen's body, which seems not very politically correct, but, you know, we're here to do a job, so... Let's get rid of these guys. -na -na -na. All right, hold on. I'm gonna pause this real quick. I'm gonna see if I can get my my little my little bubble. Okay, no, the bubble is not popping up. Sorry, getting a little distracted trying to coordinate plans to deposit and do all the things that we need to do for rent money. But, alright, it looks like all the enemies in here are dead. And how's everyone's day going? I hope everyone's day is alright. My day was... is much better now. Especially because I stopped at the dispensary. Got myself something good for whenever I run out of what I got. Kind of hoping it can last me another, like, two days or so. But we'll have to... It's probably not going to. It's probably not going to. Take a little snack real quick. And then we'll continue. Scrumptious. All right. But yeah, we had a we had a shitty day at work. Work's been trying some bullshit lately. They've been trying to do their thing that I've complained about since I started uploading videos, which is my work just always trying to rag on me, and I don't fucking understand why. I'm 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 gonna jerk myself off a little bit real quick. I am one of their most valuable workers. I basically come in every single day. I never ask to leave when they're trying to, you know, ask people if they want to go home. I'm always the first one to be like, no, I'm good, don't worry about it. Okay, that was a lot. But I, I never really, like, ask to leave. I'm always there to work. They can send me basically anywhere because I can basically be relied on to do anything anywhere. So it's frustrating when I do more work than anybody else who's in my position where I'm at. And then they'll, like, get mad at me, like, they're always mad that, you know, like, once a day, I go to the fucking bathroom, and I'm gone off the slide for ten minutes. Now, you might think, wow, a ten minute bathroom break, that's a lot. And it's like, well, yeah, but there's also a minute to walk there, a minute to walk back. Should have paid attention. And then there's also a minute to wipe your ass. And then a minute to wash your hands. So it's like, yo, is being in the bathroom for six minutes really that long? And like today, you know, I wasn't even in the bathroom for 10 minutes. I was in the bathroom for six minutes. I kept very specific, because of the way my work is, I have to keep very specific track of how long I'm gone for. And of course the supervisor is like. Uh, yeah the slide was 100%. Like do you think that was an appropriate time to go to the bathroom? And like I had to t like figure out a nice way of telling her. Like bro I don't give a fuck. Like I really don't. Especially because the guy who was running the slide. Didn't know what he was doing. So he was basically giving me 
a shitload of extra work. All right, let's go back the other way. He was basically giving me a shitload of extra work because where he was pushing packages down on our slide, um, I think I took it on my my actual phone. Mm. I don't have it on this one. Um, but the big metal slide where all the packages float down from. Okay. Um, he was basically pushing shit down in front, like in the front part of the slide where I was standing. Now, normally that wouldn't be a big deal because I'm usually always working where the heavy flow is. Like, that's what I do. That's why my work likes me so much. But they were leaving the back end of the slide. Um, there was boxes that kept... Uh, for, like, the first two hours, a couple boxes would get stuck over one of the sensors, and one of the arms that pushes the boxes down the slide from the conveyor belt one of them will just stay engaged and it won't turn it won't retract so the way that, that ends up affecting the slide is that when it does that and that ar that last arm stays out now you have a situation where the slide is only open like fucking um only like 66%, like two thirds of the slide are even like workable at that point because the rest of it won't fill because the stop arm is out stopping it. And this guy for two hours, this supervisor was just letting that happen. And, you know, instead all the work is getting pushed onto me, which again, in a vacuum, I really wouldn't care about it. But then when I go to the bathroom, and they're treating me as if the six minutes I was gone for is the reason why things are messed up. And it's like, dog, you guys are mismanaging the entire work area. And then you're like blaming me for it. Like me being gone for six minutes is the reason why this bitch has been fucked up for two hours. Are you serious? You cannot be serious. And, like, that's the shit that gets in my fucking craw. It's like, yo, you guys rely on me like a motherfucker for everything. Am I going to have to do the mother thing? All right. We're going to follow the wall. We're going to do that thing that we do. I was going to say, this room looks new. This doesn't look like a room I've been in yet. We're going to have to do the stick to the left thing. Well, I guess it's the character's left. Um, the my left, the character's right. Whatever. Nerd. Oh, pussy. I think we got rid of all the evil. Okay, there we go. That was all we needed. Thanks to you, the queen is saved. The queen will not become a demon. I have not been saved. Now I am so thin I can't move. Now she's fucking atrophied. Just put a little bit of weight on just to put it nice and even. Oh shit. Okay. Alright. What? Now. It must be hard for you to live on an island at your age.
So do we have to figure out why the why she's thin now? Treasure chest door open. Okay, so the queen will just get better on her own. That's fine. I like that they're not pretending like she's going to be just fine right away. That it'll take, you know, a minute. Was that what was back here? Is that what is in this door? Mm -hmm. Nope. That door is still just there for decoration. Anyway. And then the fact that, like, when another area after, like, after basically do treating me like that, not much long after, they end up, like, asking me to go to a different area so that way I can make sure it's not... Wait. Did you have it? Why did you have it? Huh. Hmm. Okay. Well. Anyway. Anywho. What was over here? Oh. Kitchen. Don't give a fuck about that fucking place. Fuck this bitch and her castle. Alright. Let's stop at the inn. And then we'll switch Sten for Jean. And get that jackass up. Get him some leverage. Because he needs it. When I was like... That's the part that's frustrating with me. Is like, I do more than anybody else does. I don't go home the way that everybody else does when they're trying to fucking um, get out of work and shit. You know, I'm not one of the people doing that shit. I can go everywhere. I'm there every day. Nice. So cool. And then they'll mismanage everything and then look at you as the employee and be like, hmm, why is it fucked up here? And you just look at him and you're like, I don't know, bro. Why is it fucked up? It's pretty cool for a trick you can only do fucking once. Wasn't there something I got that... I like it being a little more balanced. I don't know what Vigor does, actually, though. Oh, wait, no. It was him that I needed to give it to. I don't even know how long I've been recording for. Where was... Should be over here. And then it pissed me off because my uh, my supervisor, when she was like arguing with me, she was like, you're gone off the slide all the time. And I'm like, what are you talking about? I was in the bathroom one time. What do you mean? She's like, no, you're gone all the time. 
they're including in that when I step off the slide for like 60 seconds to go take a fucking sip of some Gatorade. <clears throat> and I only do that like every like fucking 40, 45 minutes. So it's like, wow, you're including all of that in me being fucking gone all the time? Bro, get the fuck out of here. She's like, well, why can't you just bring your drink up here? It's like, well, because generally your drink will fucking fall down the slide because, you know, when heavy shit comes down and you drop it. Ooh, ouch. A lot of times, you know, that'll knock your shit down. Give me one sec, though. Come on. Go ahead and fade. All right, sorry. I just had to blow my nose. Hopefully that's going to feel a little better. And then they want me to, like, just let somebody know when you have to go to the bathroom. And it's like, bro. Nobody else has to do that shit. It's like this weird thing where in order to, for them to treat me like everybody else, I have to do things that... Bro. I just got hit. I remember this place. I remember my grandfather being here. I think he was stuck here. I think this might have been the area where he stopped playing the game. Because I remember him being here for what seemed like forever. This is my memory town. The town I grew up in is to the east. To the East. Somewhere in this world, there's a memory tower where important memories are stored. Well, chances are, I'm going to find a fucking demon there. Because that seems very on brand for everything going on in this game. Alright, this seems like the importi Importante house. What? Get down here. Get down here. Is that it? Can you not go down or anything? So I can't communicate with this one. All right, well, it looks like there's a door in the back. Let me Zelda my way through here. Are you really? That is wild. Shows a door in back. But no doors in the back. That is... <sighs> Stupid. A demon who devours your heart attacked the town of memory. Since then, I can't talk right. So I can't buy anything? What? Oh. Shitty for everyone. Okay. Um...
Let's sell that. Sell you. What the fuck I fucking used you for? Whoa, 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 whoa. Sweet. I also remember my grandfather playing this area with the sound off for some reason. I wonder if he was stuck here for so long that he just started to hate the fucking song. Okay. If I could stop messing up, though, that would be nice. I'm so close. I need I don't know where the moon drop is. Okay, so you can sell. Okay. So you don't do... I can't buy any items. No schneidums. That was not the button I pushed. But thank you for trying, game. Thank you for trying. Alright, give me one sec. Let me get distracted. Dun 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 whoopie 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 doopie doo. <clears throat> yes, we shall continue. Especially because all we really got is <clears throat> town to the east. Are there enemies out here? Okay, there are. We're just not finding them. Okay, so items in this town. Story of the demon. There's the demon that takes over your heart when you are vulnerable. That person's appearance doesn't change much, but the soul is lost to the demon, so you don't know what he looks like. But I'm sure he's responsible for making me senile. Yes. When tragedy hits the world, brave men guided by a dragon will appear. But the dragon clan no longer exists, so this legend also has no meaning. I mean, does the clan really need to exist? Seems like all this needed is one. If you go north, you can go back to the town where you were much younger. Okay, so that one will be where there's, like, kids? Do you want to hear about the dragon clan? Long ago, there was a clan of dragons. They had great powers. Enough to easily wipe out the world, but one day they disappeared. Why or where they went, nobody knows. Nobody knows. Hopefully there will be somebody in here to talk to. Not some bullshit door, not a door thing. Bro.
I don't know why they would show me a door and people I can't access. Supra whack. Next time on Whackin' Ball Z. Alright, can I please get a fight? Fight, 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 fight. Thank you. Oh god, these guys? Fuck. Fuck yeah. Okay, Gene moved up a level. Good, because this douchebag needs it. Rapid R? What the fuck? Fuck it. Weave? I like counterattacks. Oh, yes, I do. Mm -mm. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah, fuck yeah. I'm going to guess the tower is over there. V head. What the fuck is a V head? Completely forgot about these enemies' existences. Not visually. Yeah, like, I don't remember V head. That's whack. <laughs> How dare you? Tower over here? I said there was a tower somewhere. Do the enemies also go by the age of where I'm at? Because they said this is when you were much younger. Ooh, a great tree, though. Never mind. Never mind. Ooh, hello, Mimics. Like the favorite thing ever. No. What the fuck did that do? And after all that, I'm no closer to knowing. There are three towns. That's strange. There should be only two towns. Uh... Did you find the tower? I believe you can see it from the lake in the west. Um... And is there going to be another person in here hiding? Yep. And I'm going to guess this is going to go three for three on not being able to talk to him worth shit. Down. Down. Nope. 
All right. Well, that is unfortunately, I think, going to be it for the day, guys. Uh, we've made it to not just the memory world, but we've made it to a core memory that I have of this game. And I didn't even remember it until I saw it. And, oof. It hits me right in the nostalgia feels. I love it. So, let's save the game. And then I'll be back in a few days with more of it. And we'll figure out what's going on in here. And how to kill whatever diamond is uh, being a fuck. So, yep. Till then, guys. Peace. Careful on your journey.